Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're looking at continuing the GHQ Huey helicopter painting, and we're going to do the glass. And I'll do the, both helicopters a different color, so you can sort of get an idea on what the colors look like. And green is the glass for the top of the Hueys. If you do some googling, you'll see that the top panels here are normally painted a light, well, colored glass, light green. So um. Today we'll just be using a clear green, that's that green colour there. We use a blue, which is just a, a light blue, and for one of the helicopters for the main glass, and then we'll use this purple, which we used on the Heinz for the other helicopter. So we'll get straight into it. And the reason I'm doing the two different colours is so you can sort of see uh, which one you sort of like and, and uh, what you might go for. On your builds first color we use is the green to do the top of the canopies when I can get the green working so it's clear green And the brush I'm using is triple uh, is five zeros. Now I just wet the brush first, just so it has a little bit of water on it. That just helps keep it all together. And these sections that we're painting on the model, I mean, they are small. Sorry, a bit blurry. I'm trying to get that light right. these sections up here we'll set the one just aside there we'll do the other one that's the, the green done for the two helicopters if I'm unsure about um, uh, helicopter or colours to use on a helicopter, I do just I just do some googling and have a look and and see what's around. Next one we we'll use is blue, and we'll paint our first helicopter. This, this blue, you only need a drop of paint. The, the models are so small, and if I had more models, I'd do more Hueys, I'd do them all at once to um, try and maximise using up that paint because sometimes you do waste a little bit of paint. And some areas will touch up after if we get a little bit too much paint where we think we don't need it. So this is just using a light blue, but of course you can use the darker color, which we'll use in a minute. Remember the, the models are tiny, so it can be hard to get paint onto them.
and later on we'll go around and just touch up around this helicopter where we've just gone outside the windows a little bit they can be touched up after don't panic we'll, we can sort that out I'll put that one up there and then I'll change to the purple I'll use the same using the same brush um, if I go out you can see here over on the right where I'm moving that paintbrush around here this palette that's the green and the blue I use just in the corner there and I just have some water here and I just rinse out in water quickly same brush and the next one we'll use is the purple clear purple just give them a good shake I normally do that off camera so you'll see there just put a little bit like that that's that's plenty there and I mean it's just a drop um, small models and then we just start back with that process and this is the unsupported builds where they're not based on anything to hold on to this is this is showing just a different technique if you want to do it just by holding the models I prefer to mount them on something but yeah like I said we'll, we'll go through a few different techniques and ways They are fine, they are hard to do, best just take your time, I mean everyone knows that. And that's the two, I'll just lay them on this side, that's the two sort of colours I use if you want to get that, the two different looks, so a darker look which some people go for and then a lighter look which a lot of people go for too, so and then the, the tops are always at light green and that's how I paint the glass on the Huey helicopters and the Microarmor. Thanks for watching.